In this video, I have to complete every single Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Easter egg with Black Ops 2 guns solo. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like on it. And if you want to see more content like this, why don't you subscribe? It's completely free and you can always change your mind later. With all that said, enjoy this video. I'm knee deep in zombie shit with no ammo. Okay, this is very, very weird. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All oh, we are doing the Shadows of Evil Easter egg alongside all the other ones that are supported in this mod. That being, I'm pretty sure every one apart from DE and GK. We are doing every Every single Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Easter egg in this video with the T6 mod enabled. Now, this already feels very weird, and I can probably guarantee that you guys are going to be feeling the exact same level of weird throughout this entire playthrough because this just looks wrong, man. But, but why, why is Jessica Rose holding the M1911 from Black Ops 2? What's going on here? We've also got the Olympia. I'm pretty sure the M14 will be somewhere as well. Yeah, there it is. You know, we're just absolutely Black Ops 2 in it up. Okay, let's grab the Fumigator here. Tilt the beast mode. I still remember these patterns from all those years ago, man. Man, it genuinely feels like yesterday that Black Ops 3 came out. I wish it was yesterday, man. Please take me back to that era of my life. Get a little bit deep for 30 seconds into the video. But um, yeah, we're doing this mod again. I, but I feel like I didn't give it enough love in the last video, you know? The Origins Easter egg, we did it last video and the video before that. So I, I don't know. I, I guess you guys weren't feeling it. So we'll, we'll do every single Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Easter egg. Because, you know, BO3 is just elite, man. You can't go wrong with it. Grab some quick revive here. Oh, they've got the fucking original soda bottles as well. That's sick. I know we saw that in the last video. Video. I'm just saying I didn't know they ported them over to the Black Ops 3 maps as well. Got this nuke here. Uh, I wonder what gun is over here now that the KRM's gone. Yeah, it's the Remington. Okay, this is different. Don't know if I like it, but it's different. What's on here? Okay, that's a shout. The B23R over the LK9. Fuck yes. This is going to take way longer than usual due to the fact that Gobblegums are disabled because, you know, this is meant to be like BO2. So bear with is all I'm saying because, you know, the no perkaholic thing might get a little bit on my nerves and all that shit. You know what I mean? Just as long as we're getting a ritual done every couple of rounds, we should be on pace. All we got to do is get the swords and, you know, slap down the book and all that. And the fucking, oh, the, the thingy step might be a bit difficult. The, uh, the flag step is what I'm on about because uh, we don't have uh, fear and headlights. So it might make it a little bit more difficult than it usually is, but, you know, we should be fine. We should be completely fine. And unfortunately, you can't load more than one mod, so we're going to have to just get up to the Shadow Man step and then put him in the summoning key, and then that'll be that. Because I don't know how to compile mods. If anybody in the comments can help me with that, please let me know. And if you haven't already, make sure to drop a like on the video. And if you want to see more content like this, why don't you subscribe? It's completely free. You can always change your mind later. Probably said that in the intro of this video. I'm just stressing it because I've been stuck on 2.38k now, trying to get a 2.5 at the end of the year, but I don't know. We'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. We are racking up the points with this B23. 2,500 already, which chilling bro where is this last zombie i hear him but i can't see him okay there we go all right we're on the round four we're actually killing these rounds i'm not gonna lie i was i was like mindlessly killing there bro the, oh, the, that looks so wrong a fucking gobblegum machine just replaced with a barrel ah i feel right okay let's do a bit of waterfront first let's get this open why does that not use that usually works i was gonna say yeah what the fuck okay right let's grapple up here let's knock this down we should also be getting the uh the swords done pretty early because i have been kind of like practicing a little bit before this video but yeah, let's get this. Let's get this nice and tight. Okay, we've completely ran out of ammo in the B23R already. So what I think we're going to do is we're going to grab this. And then we're going to do a quick little circle around here. A little circle around this zombie too. And then we're going to grab an MP5. And then we're going to... Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention as well, even on Black Ops 3 maps. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention as well, even on Black Ops 3 maps, it is the two-hit system. And that's really not a good thing for like, you know, like the doing the swords when you're looking out the window. And, you know, everything else because the two-hit system sucks Arse. And given that the fact that we don't have BO2 weapons, not good, pal. Not good. And given that the fact that we've only got BO2 weapons, and I, I don't know if Widow's Wine's enabled, it's not looking good for us. Okay, second ritual. Here we go. It does feel quite nice, actually, to, like, revisit the BO2 weapons. I don't play Black Ops 2 enough, because, mainly because Plutonium's buggy as fuck. I do really, really like the gun choices that they use for BO2, though. And I love the small little details to do with this mod, man. It's so sick. Okay, we've almost completely run out of ammo again. Okay, right. We popped ahead. That'll do. Grab a Tommy gun here. Yeah, you know, you can't go wrong with it. I mean, this 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 map is basically based off Mob of the Dead, so... Okay, there we go. Probably gonna end up keeping the Tommy gun, actually, because this thing is unreal on this game. Right, it's got the Magua Heart here, because we do fucking need the Bot and Servant if we're doing the Easter Egg. The flag step is literally impossible without it. And it's also been just ages since I've played a proper game of... Sh it's also been ages since I've played a proper game of Shadows of Evil. It's kind of nuts. I always just run to the Gobblegum Machine and get a shot and free and all that good stuff, but, you know, we're not doing it this time. Right, let's become the Beast here. Uh, go up here. Get Jug on because we are going to need that. Uh, and get this on. Jump down here quick. That open. Get that open. Do we have enough time? Do we have enough time? Oh! 
Oh, oh my god, I'm too tacky with it. I think we got everything open there. Holy shit. Oh, I forgot the power sitting down there. Oh, so that's a little bit annoying. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I fucking hate the bees on Shadows of Evil and on Rev. They're just such a shit mini boss. They're just annoying. They're not even fun. Like, dogs are scary on World of War. Like, make it a challenge. What is this shit? Right, okay. Let's quickly use this beast mode here and let's go and open that box down there and shock this on and grab the uh, detective badge, which I think is the one over here. I can't remember. Like I said, I don't play Shadows of Evil a lot, really. Like, if I had to genuinely say, the last time I played Shadows of Evil was probably my last round 100 stream, and that was time ago, bro. Right, okay, let's go do the third ritual here. We are speeding through this, but uh, the rounds are creeping up a little bit. I don't want to get too high of a round, because um, it'll make doing the swords a little bit harder than it needs to be. Okay, let's do this. This Tommy gun's actually really, really good compared to what it is in BO2. The one in BO2 sucks ass, especially when it's not packed and without double tap 2. We do have to be careful, though, because it is two hits. Them. Comment down below what you comment down below what your favorite Black Ops 2 weapon is because mine is definitely the mini Uzi or like I think it's just called the Uzi in BO2. So all the weapons in Mob of the Dead are probably some of my favorites. I can't lie. Oh my god, bro! Holy fuck! It's round six, not round 60. They're just piling out from everywhere. Okay, we're going to run up here and grab Jug before we do anything else. And then we're going to go and run and do the last ritual. PDW there, that is a solid weapon. Although we're not picking that up just yet. All right, let's grab some Jug. I love the fucking old perk bottles. And those like perk icons look like they're 4K, bro. Like they're definitely not ripped from BO2. Let's use that M1911 a little bit here because I really, really, really can't stress of how much points are going to come into how fast we can do this. Shadows of Evil is an expensive ass map. Okay, let's quickly run and do beast mode here. Let's unlock this. Is that the... Oh, I was gonna say, is that the MP5 again on the wall? But no, it's the 74U. Do that. Cross here. And over here. We're gonna hit the box, because I really need a better gun than just, you know, whatever we've got. I can't remember what we've got. I've got, like, fucking Rementia already, bro. We have the Tommy gun. Okay, yeah, the Tommy gun's decent. I do really like it. It seems to be doing a bit more damage than it usually does in Black Ops 2, but it does fall off quite quick, and I can already feel it falling off. Right, okay, let's spin the box here. Come on. Do me right, do me right, do me right. The RPD, I will take that whole heart. I think we're going to leave all the pods for now just so they'll turn purple so we have a better chance of getting the Margaret tail and all the Xenomata. just depends on when that drops. It really just depends. But we do need... The, the Apothecary Servant is like an utmost requirement. Can't do it without it, otherwise the fucking flag step will be literally impossible. That is an insta-kill. That will come in very, very handy. I'm going to give you the Gate Worm, and we are out of here, bro. Fuck you, Margua. Right, we've done all this now. I think what we're going to do now is run the train, and we'll go do the swords, because they are very, very important for the Easter Egg as well. And also upgrading them, that's going to be something as well. Holy fuck, why did that take so long? That was like nearly my entire RPD clip and it just did nothing. Okay, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. We are racking up the points as well. We'll be, we'll be able to get a pack-a-punch gun in no time. God, the mog was actually fucking terrifying. Oh my god. That was a little bit too close for comfort. I won't lie. Right, let's let's just end the round here. Right, let's go do the symbols. This should be easy enough. Uh, it's going to be Jump Cut City. Let's, let's head to... Right, let's head to Waterfront here. And I can never remember which side I'm meant to be looking out here. I think it's the right side always. Yep, okay, it is... So that's single, 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 double, single. So, hang on, you got... Right, so that was single, 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 and then there was single, double, single, and then we are changing the destination here, and we're gonna head to, I think it's Footlight? I can never remember which one you have to go to. Oh, no, it's Canals, it's Canals. I really need to touch up on my Shadows of Evil stuff, man. It's like the one map I always struggle with. They've also took away the bootlegger war by. I've only just clocked. Right, okay, off we go to Canals. I hope I'm looking out the right side here. Yep, here we go. It is four. I, why did I just have a hunch it would be four? Right, okay. Now we can kill two birds with one stone here. We can get pack a punch unlocked and we can also get the swords unlocked. And funnily enough, we actually got spat out a canal, so that means we can uh, use the rift portal here. Right, there we go. And oh, we got replaced with PhD. Okay, I see you. I see you. Kind of wish I kept my M1911 now if I knew that was going to be on the map. They are fucking sprinting, bro. It's insane. Look at this. It's round eight. Calm down. Right, okay, 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 whatever. Right, let's get this, uh, let's get these swords unlocked so it was four. It was that one and that one. Yeah, there we go. Oh my god, I'm gonna get fucked here. Please unlock, 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 unlock. Bro, let me through. Let me through. Oh my fucking god, I was about to cry. Bro, we need to pack this RPD. This is ridiculous. I didn't think there'd be this many zombies. Oh, ooh. never mind. I'll shut up. I'll shut up. All right, okay. There's one, two, three, and number four. And let's just start the ritual now and get this over and done with because I really want to pack a bunch of this RPD because I feel like it's. 
has got so much potential. I always get a bit nervous when I'm running over that thing, you know. It's fucking scary. Right, okay, let's give this a go. The Oh my god, that looks amazing. Look at the RPD, bro. It's exactly like Mob. Did the Mob did Mob have the did Mob of the Dead have the RPD? I'm really not sure. Eh, whatever. Oh, that's a Mogwa spawning in. Hello. I'm absolutely sick to death of Mogwas already, and we've barely even just started. Oh shit. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god. God, I am amazing at this game. Two hit system and everything. You can't double pack. That's kind of shit. Don't cock block me, please. Please. Oh my god, that's just not fair, bro. Okay, that's our first down. That's our first down. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Nah, don't even stress, bro. We got this. We're fine. We're so fine. Oh my god, bro. I am absolutely shitting my pants. Right, we need to fucking get quick revive now or jug or literally anything. You're spawning it in. I'd prefer to grab quick revive first, you know, so all this progress doesn't just go down the Shitter. Right, there we go. Very nice. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. That insta kill would come in lovely right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. How am I not dead? Oh my god. How did I make it out of that? Bro, this Black Ops 2 mod is not a force to be reckoned with. Fucking hell, this is stressful. Okay, I think we're we're, we're all right now though. I just I need to get better like set up. I think. Right. What what's up here? I think double tap two's up here. So we're gonna grab that. We're also gonna go back to canals and grab Juggernog because it is very very important that we have that. We gotta get them extra hits in while we can. Okay, there's Juggernog. Let's also get this open and grab this fuse. And now I feel a little bit more safer to, you know, go about and do my eggs and stuff like that. We'll go do that now. The sooner we get the Apothecary Sword, the sooner we can stop worrying about having to fucking do them. There we go. And I didn't unlock this. What the fuck? Right, let's get the uh, PhD on here as well. And let's set our egg down just there. Right, okay. I am ready for next round, bro. I'm not ready for the fact that we don't have Widow's Wine anymore, but I guess this is just going to, once again, make me a better Zombies player. Feeling good about this. As soon as we get this done, it's a home stretch because because I can do every other Easter egg like the back of my hand. Okay, meatball. Okay, meatball round might be a little bit, you know. We just gotta be careful because our HP is fucking low, man. I'm so hyper focused right now, bro. And this is only one round. There we go. Okay. We are gonna need to grab speed caller at some point as well because the reload time on this RPD is a little bit ridiculous. Okay, it's round 11. We're doing fine. We're doing absolutely fine. Right, let's see what Tommy Gun does actually unpack. Oh my god, it's insane. Double tap two is actually such a godsend, man. Especially, oh, bro, with insta kill. Oh. So good, bro. <laughs> okay, that's that one done. Let's run up to canals and go do that one. Honestly, this step really isn't that bad. It's just, you know, the whole arch oven thing with all the margos that gets on my nerves. Because it's either you do it flawlessly or you fuck it up royally. Right, okay, I'm not going to play about here. I'm actually just going to use my RPD because I don't fancy going down again. That was really bad. Okay, that's that done. Let's get the fuck. We can go to footlight now. I think that one's open. And then we last one we have to do is canals. Holy shit, we're pretty optimized. I need to figure out where speed caller is as well. I I think it's actually in Waterfront, if I'm not mistaken. That is a purple pod as well. Let's go harvest that shit. The fire sale? I mean, I'll take it. Where's the nearest box at? Uh, I'm just gonna run the fucking footlight, I guess. Probably only gonna get one spin of it, but you know, we need to go here anyway. It's fine. Come on, give me a ray gun or something. Make my life that little bit easier. Come on. Fucking five, seven. No, 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 uh, you know, fuck you too, game. Right, we are doing absolutely amazing. I am. Oh, and a purple pod. I will take that. Please be the Magua Tentacle. No, okay. We can start looking for Xenomata soon. And also, I feel like the, the shield is probably worth my time. Okay, there we go. And the last one we need to do is Waterfront. And I don't think it's open, so we're going to go back there and go into beast mode. That's another purple pod. Can we quickly, quickly harvest this? It's another fire sale. I don't need that. Let's speed caller on here. And let's also open this box. There's another purple pod up here. That's very nice. Oh my fucking god. There is so many. Why are they all up here? What the fuck? That was ridiculous. The AN-94, bro, I just got that from a drop. What the fuck? I feel like the, like the zombies are just on fucking smoke, and I don't know why. All right, okay, we're done. I, yeah, but I still feel like the zombies are just on absolute crack cocaine. Maybe I'm just, like, shit at zombies. All right, okay, let's grab the fuse as well here. Quickly harvest this pod while we've got the chance. Hurry up, give me the tentacle. KSG. KSG's a good shotgun, though. Another purple pod there. Fucking zombie cash or whatever the fuck that is, I don't know. Oh, my God. 
Right, I need my sword, bro. Get this rift portal open as well. It's always good to have them all open, I guess. Oh, no, you fucking cunt, man. Okay, I think it's end of round. We should be okay. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Don't stress. It's just that that is so annoying, man. We're going to have to find the shield pieces as well because I can't do this without the shield at this rate. All right, give me the fucking quick revive. That's our last quick revive as well, man. Fucking KSG again. I swear to God, where is my Magma tentacle, bro? The Elsat? That's a shout, but I don't think I'm going to grab it. I'm going to quickly run back and grab double tap. Then we can go grab our sword and then we can start the upgrade process this round, actually. There is one of the shield pieces. We're going to go and find the other one as well because I can't do it without it. There's another one of the shield pieces and I'm guessing the last one will be in canals. I feel like this is definitely worth my time because holy shit, if we, if we had the shield there, we wouldn't have went down. And there's our last shield piece. Okay, let's go build this shit in the canals. Okay, I feel so much better now. Plonk our egg in here and let's grab our sword. Very, very nice. I think we're going to use our last beast mode as well to open this door up here because it's just really readable. It means we don't have to go through the fucking portal all the time. It's nice. I'm going to head over to the burlesque now to grab our arch over, man. We can start this round, which is nice. We've just got to be really careful for these Magwas, man, because they are fucking fatal. Magwa tentacle, please. Ooh, I, well, I mean, I'll take that too. <laughs> fucking sick. Thank you for the arch over kinds. We just got a Mark II from a fucking pod. Is it a one shot? Bro, it doesn't affect them. It doesn't affect- What is this? What the fuck? Okay, the Mark II is shit. Against these guys anyway. The bullets still work on him. Okay, yeah, no, this RPT is still fucking killing it. Right, there we go. That's the first one done. Very, very nice. Right, okay, let's go do the one at spawn and then we've only got two more left to do after that. Okay, we are doing very well, I think anyway. Two downs isn't that good, but you know. Probably wasn't the, probably wasn't the brightest idea to do this mid-round either, but you know, hey-ho. Here we go. Fuck, we really need speed cooler if we've got a Mark II. Ah, shit. And this is another reason why we need speed cooler, because our main weapon is a fucking RPD. Oh my fucking god, no, 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 no. Okay, 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 right, well that's that, that, we're away, we're away, we're away, it's fine. Yeah, fuck you, Magua, we're away. As long as we still, as long as we keep this ray gun reloaded, we can get anything we want out of our way. Okay, quickly grab speed cooler here. Bro, no! Give me speed cooler, holy fuck! Thank you. Oh, you can do like the B hop with this. This is kind of sick. Okay, there's another one somewhere. I wasn't expecting this to take as long as it has. Fucking hell. Okay, we've got one more head to pop here. Oh, shit. We've got another one that we need to pop. Oh, there we go. Right, okay. Let's get this round ended and let's get ourselves over to the other place, which I think we can do water from next. There we go. Right, this is the one that I usually go down on mainly because it's so close quarters. Oh, wait. This might be like a perfect... Op that's just a Margo regardless. That's fucking... That, I, that's awful. Why would you do this to me? Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Okay, okay, get the fuck away from here. Oh my god, Margo. A lot of bees as well. Oh my god. Oh shit, was that the fucking Xenomata thing that I needed? Right, okay, he's dead. Nice. No Xenomata? Really? That sucks. Let's just step away. We're doing quite well. I haven't downed once yet. I'm not jinxing it. Holy fuck, why can't you sprint when you're reloading? You can do that in BO3. I think without this RPD, we would have been dead a long time ago. Right, okay, we've got one more to do after this round. Right, okay, please just give me the fucking tentacle thing. No, bro, come on. No Xenomata still, really? Well, I don't think we're getting the Apothecary Serpent anytime soon. We're going to have to wait for another one of those rounds. Fine, we move, we move. Right, we're going to do canals and then we are done. Margo Tentacle, please, come on. Yes! Okay, there we go. And there's the Xenomata, holy fuck, it's meant to be. Right, we've got to go build this somewhere. Where I, where I don't particularly know. It's fine, though, we'll find a place. I think we're actually going to swap out the Mark II because mainly because it can't dig down Margos. Or what I could do is grab Mule. I can't grab Mule, okay? We've, oh, we've got four perk limit, fuck. Any other day, I would have literally took the Mark II over the Apothecant. Over the RPD, sorry, but it's just because it can't kill Magwas. Right, okay, that's last zombie. We don't have to end the round yet. I'm gonna go build the Apothecant Servant, and then I'm gonna go grab the fuse for the last uh, Civil Protector thing, and then we can go do the last Archer over. Again, everything we could possibly can done this round. Build the Apothecant. Thank you very much. I think the only fuse that we haven't got right now is the Footlight one, so let's go grab that very quickly. And there it is. Okay, right, let's go do the last Archer over them. Stick the other fuse in for the uh, civil protector, then we can actually go start the flag step. We are doing very well. We're on pace. Right, okay. Final archer over So let's get this over and done with. Right, there's one dead. I think the other one still has all three of his heads. Yeah, he does. And there we go. That's our archer over done. Right, let's go back to footlight. Grab our upgraded sword. Go press F on Nero's fucking Cronorium book looking half thing. And let's give this flag step a bash, shall we? I think we can actually start it this round, which is probably a good thing because I don't think many zombies actually spawn. Okay, thank you very much for my sword. Yeah, bro, the flag step's easy. What do you mean? It's so easy on solo. No, no fucking gobblegum. I cannot believe this is actually a real step, bro. 
and then it just, it, it, you know, it's away. Or it's floating. I think it's, it just has to float or some shit. I don't know. Well, I guess there's nothing really left to do now but start the flag steps. Let's give it a go. It's going to end the round, isn't it? Probably. Maybe. Yes, no, maybe so. Wait, really? It's not going to end the round? What? Right, okay, let's shoot this fucking shadow man. Shoot one of these. Where's the shadow man at? Where is he, the cunt? Can he reload, 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 reload. Did the fucking flag... Bro nah, that's not fair. Can I just go back and grab it again? Oh, if i got to wait around, I can never remember. No, I can just go back and grab it again. It's fine. This step is incredibly difficult solo. It's ridiculous. Okay, let's give him a shot. No, fuck off. Fuck off. Ah, it's gonna... That might break, to be fair with you. I have not got... Oh, my God, bro. What the... F okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Okay, 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 okay. What I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cast this out, and then we'll slap it down here. All right, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Right, can you sod off, please? Get it off. Oh, you're doing my boxing, pal. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, the sword's actually doing bits. Holy shit. There we go. Okay, right, I think we're nearly done. Or we are done, or we've just gotta run this back to the uh, the bit now. Yeah, we just gotta run it back. We just gotta run it back. Gotta be really fucking careful, though. If it gets destroyed, I think I'd cry. Which shit, where do we place this? Oh, yeah, the canals, the canals, the canals. I'm just hella stupid, bro. Bro, please, no, 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 no. No meatball. Bad meatball. Right, there we go. I have never done that solo before. Holy shit, this is new territory. Right, okay. I'm pretty sure now we... Oh, okay, there's a Margo spawning. I can't remember if you have to do... Is a new round started? What the fuck? No, you have to do it for every district, I remember. Yeah, you've got to clear a round again. Okay. There is a Margo coming as well. <laughs> I've never actually managed to do that solo. That is very, very cool. I think now one of them should be lit up. It won't be all four. Oh, wait, are all four? No, no, no. There's one keeper, but yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. This is the step we can't do. Well, we can do this bit, but we can't, like, actually drive the gateworm into them. The Marastagua is really helping out here. I just nearly jumped off to my fucking death. Oh, my God. That was the most... That might have actually been the most brain-dead thing I've ever done in Zombies. Here, right, let's grab the flag, and let's do the one in the central bit. Is there a one in the central bit? I can never remember. There's a one here. Right, we'll do this one. Fuck it. Oh, piss off. See, the problem is, you finish reloading this thing, and then there's like 10 more meatballs coming from 80 different directions. And then you've got to deal with him as well. It's fucking awful, man. This step's terrible. I will take that max ammo very fucking gladly. Thank you very much. Okay, piss off you. Ah, now nah, this thing might break, to be fair. Where is he? I heard him. I fucking heard him. There we go. He's dead. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Okay, there we go. Get that max ammo, and let's go plonk this thing down as it should be in the Footlight District, or the Burlesque, or whatever it's called. Oh my god. I didn't realize they did as much damage as they did. Oh, Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. No, I haven't lost the flag either. Okay, good. Okay, that's that. Oh my god, chat, we're doing so well. Okay, yeah, let's get out of here. I think we're gonna do two more districts and then we're done, basically, with the Shadows Easter egg. We just gotta time it with the Shadow Man and then we're done. Let's get the Civil Protector in here as well, just in case we go down. And that is a max ammo. Oh my god, we fucking timed that so well. It just took out the uh, Margo when he jumped down. It's actually a high round strat. I'm gonna get this zombie to break my shield and we're gonna go quickly run and grab a new one because they are really useful for the meatball rounds. Well, break my shield, come on. Look, Civil Protector, I get it, you're doing your job, pal. But I really want this zombie to break my shield. Thank you. Shield. Right, okay. We can go grab the uh, the flag again now. And I think we're going to do waterfront next. Do I know the route? No, I do not. Are we going to try it anyway? Yes, we are. Right, off we pop. Canal was probably the worst direction we could have gone if we're going to waterfront. I can't lie. But, you know, it's fine. Doesn't matter. Oh, wait, hang on. There's a one for, there's a one for here? What? Okay. Pay oh, wait, no. That actually... Oh, that kills him too. What? That's a thing? I didn't know about that. Chat. Wait, does the Civil Protector shoot him as well? Oh my god, I think this- What- Bro, what happened to my boy? Okay, that's that done. Where's my max ammo at? Nowhere? Okay. Wait, is there only one for this? No, 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 no. There's another one. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There's another bit that we need to slam it down. Where is it? Oh, it's there. It's there. It's there. Go, 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 go. All right, where's the Shadow Man at? Where is he? Piss off. You're not cool. You're not anything. Okay, yeah, this is going to be impossible without the fucking... Without this thing, it's actually going to be like... Yeah, this is fucking ridiculous, man. Oh my god. Okay, run, 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 run. That was absolute sheer luck that we got that done there. Okay, after this, we've only got one more region that we needed. I can't believe we've done this all first try. This is insane. There we go. Right, that's three out of four done. We just got to end this round and then go on to round whatever, 19. Right, there's another mog we're spawning. Zombies are spawning back in too. This is fine. Let's get the Civil Protector back down here. Right. Royally focusing up here because I don't want to die now. It'd probably be like the worst time to die. Okay, hopefully that ends the round. I can't remember what one we haven't done now. Yeah, that did end the round. Nice. What one haven't we done? Ne does Nero have one? Surely not. Nero doesn't have one. Wait, he's got to. He's the only other ritual. Oh, oh, okay. I guess we'll give it a go. I have not got a clue where this thing's going to be, by the way. Like, literally not a fucking monkey's. Is this just going to be an easy street? Bro, where's this flag at? He's literally like the only one we haven't done. Where's the bit where you like put it down? Bro, I'm absolutely clueless as to where I'm meant to put these fucking flags. Chat, never back down, never what? It's fine. We'll keep looking for it. It's not there. It's not waterfront either. Oh, there's one here. What the fuck? Okay, I just absolutely hyper-focused there. Apparently, that was the 
last little bit that we had to do there, and we can go fucking charge this thing up now, I think. I hope so, anyway, because that was, like, the only other option I feel like we had. Unless there's, like, another letter thing I'm missing, which I'm going to be, like, royally pissed off about if there is. Oh my, oh, my God, there's another one. Where? Bro, what the fuck? And I didn't get a max ammo either. How's this shit fair? Is there one in canals? I, I, bro, where would this even be? No, there's not one in canals. Fine, the search never stops, bro. Oh, there it is. It's waterfront. Okay. Oh, I shattered, you bastard. Okay, we're going to do that one again. It's fine. Don't worry about it. What I will worry about, though, is the amount of ammo we've got. God damn. We are running low. Gonna need, like, a B round or something soon unless we can grab one. I think I'm just gonna let the civil protector do his thing and end the round for me. There's also probably a bunch of purple pods that we can go about and harvest to try to get a max ammo. I think there was a one down here, if I'm not mistaken. No, that one's not purple. Oh, no, that one's purple. I knew I wasn't tripping. Bro, the fucking KSG. I didn't need a KSG. Come on. I need some prayers in the fucking chat for me, bro. Prayers in the comments, I guess. This is a video. I don't know why I keep saying chat. It's like an addiction. And it, I did wasn't a max ammo round. Okay. This is not good. Bro, we're so close. Please don't let it end like this. Come on. Right, okay. The mog was dead. Like, that's that's a problem dealt with. That's an insta kill. That'll be nice. Oh my god, that was too close. Bro, where can I get more ammo from? This is actually... Uh, uh, bro, I'm a gobblegum player, but this is ridiculous. Come on. I think we're gonna have to swap it out for another weapon. I can't lie. Fuck it, we've got the point budget to do it, and I, we kinda just need you, bro. RPD has served us well. I'm not swapping out for an RPG. That is absolutely criminal. Maybe this will be a B round, question mark? It's not a B round, bro. It's so over. The fucking M8A1? Nah, I can't take that shit, bro. I'm sorry. It's still... A, what, for, what? It's still one-shot headshotting? Whatever this is, shoot. That is the python. That thing sucks Oh, I cannot take that. Please just give me a good gun. I forgot how the majority of BO2 guns are just BO1 Russell. The hammer? Never mind. I'll shut my mouth. Go ahead and get this open here just so we can run and quickly pack a punch the hammer because we do need a pack a punch gun desperately. Oh my god, purple pod. Please, please bless me. Bless me. Bless me. Bless me. Please. Bro, that is literally the polar opposite of what I wanted. I don't want more guns. I want more ammo. This is going to be risky, by the way. Oh, wait. No, hang on. We got the sword. We should be okay. We don't even need it, bro. We don't even need it. We're just too good. We're too good like that. Please be a fucking B round. Oh my god, it's been too long. Bro, are we just not getting another B round? What the fuck? I guess we're just gonna have to ammo manage like crazy until the next one. Unless this pod right here, this pod in question, unless this blesses me up. It did not bless me up, bro. Oh my god. Okay, we can start it. We can start it. I'm not wasting any time. We're doing it now. Fuck it. We are doing it live. Right, okay. Thank you very much. No, let's not, let's not waste any time here. We're gonna go footlight. I don't know which one is footlight, though. I can't lie. It's not that one. It's not wasty shotty that I keep doing that by habit. I and again, bro. Nah, nah, you stop. I need to be stopped. Are we in footlight? We are in footlight. Civil protector out here. Let's get the sword out. Slam that down. And there we go. Right, where is he? There. Shoot one there. Shoot one there. Come on, one more time. There we go. Right, that felt like it was like planned, bro. What was that shit about? Oh, God, one more. Why am I not getting a max ammo? That's not fair. Ah, oh, bro, come on. Stop fucking me over. Slam down the chain trap here. Civil protector, come on, bro. Help me out. Help me out. Help me out. That's it. Oh, my God. Run, 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 run. Back to Nero's. Back to Nero's. Back to Nero's. As soon as we've done this, we're pretty much home stretch. Come on. Oh, my God. Yes, we're done. We're done. Literally just got to shoot the Shadow Man a couple of times now. We are so done, bro. Right. Kill this Mogwa and then, you know, we'll go do this step. As long as that doesn't end the round, I think we should be good. That did end the round. Okay. Fuck it. We'll, we'll, we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. I think it ends the round anyway, regardless of what, like, what you're doing when you enter this room. Okay. Here we go. This is pretty much the final boss. Holy shit. Can you get him on the first one? No, you can't get him on the first I was going to say that's too far too easy if you could. Like, what the fuck? Okay, right. There's a max ammo there. I'll take that. All right. Let's shoot this thing down. Have we got to go about and click all of them? Yes, we do. Okay. Okay, a nuke. That helps out massively. That doesn't. That's a Mogwa. Okay, put that on. And that one. Do your things, keep us. Okay, right. He's been smashed. Ah, oh, fuck, 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 fuck. No, bro. You're joking. This is this can't be where we die. It might actually be where we die. Nah, this is a hundred and million ten percent where we die, bro. Nah, I tried my fucking hardest, man. That is ridiculous. How are you meant to do that solo? I was genuinely on that for about like 25 fucking minutes. That is actually ridiculous. GG well played, I guess. On to the next game. I need more ammo or we're going down. Okay. Wow. This already looks amazing. I actually feel like I'm playing Black Ops 2. Like I'm not even capping that. I actually genuinely felt like I loaded into Black Ops 2 there. But no, we are back on Black Ops 3 and this is the giant. This is the second map that we're doing. Like I said, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get DE working. I guess you'll just see in the video if it's there or not. It's just not 
there in the map list, like, because the, the mod itself changes the map list to, like, different kinds of maps, so ones that are, are officially supported by the mod. But you can override it, but I don't actually know how. I'm going to have to read into it a little bit. So, long story short, if these in the video, it's in the video. If not, I couldn't get it working, and I'm sorry. I think the same goes for GK, actually. I don't think that's officially supported. But wow, bro, this is what the giant would look like if it was remastered in BO2. That's kind of crazy. This mod is crazy, man. It's actually next level shit, man. The way they ported over the weapons as well, or like remade them from Black Ops 2, makes them look so nice and so like faithful to the original. It's actually like, bro, I'm glazing right now. I'm whole ass glazing. I need to remember to be careful because it still is the two hit system, but I feel like we're going to have a much easier to, oh shit, we don't have Gobblegum. I always forget about this with each map we play. Grab a PDW here. We don't give this weapon enough love in any video we do. This is definitely going to be one of the quicker ones because I feel like I could do the flytrap Easter egg in my sleep, especially on BO3. Bro, this is such a cool mod, man. I can't get over it. The little lens flare they've added to like the guns and how, you know, when you shoot them, like, look, it's so bright compared to the used weapons of BO3. I don't know. It just adds like more flair to the weapon, I guess. And it just makes it look nice. All right, let's get this next door open here. And I think we should just probably get the power on right here. I'm not going for a speed run by any means, but I do want to get this done as fast as possible so I can get this video out for you guys as fast as Mule kick here, bro. I've never seen that. Let's grab some more PDW ammo here. And I am looking for this last zombie because he's doing my head. There he is. All right, there we go. We're on round four. So we've got to link all these teleporters first, you know, the usual dirty stuff. And then we've got to get a packed weapon. This shouldn't take too long. I don't know. Bro, when Zombies Chronicles 2, bro, when Zombies Chronicles 2 eventually drops, this is going to be like this mod, but with amazing graphics with like die rise and stuff. Bro, I'm so hyped. Leave your guesses down in the comments below about when Zombies Chronicles 2 is going to release. This PDW is absolutely tearing into them. I forgot how good of a weapon it is. Like I said, I just don't play BO2 enough, mainly because Plutonium's just buggy as shit. It's so hard to get in a game with people. Okay, let's get ZC open here and let's go link this teleport. That is a weird looking quick revive machine. Why is it so blue? Grab it here. They are keeping the uh, BO2 perk bottles. You love to see it. That is the AN94 on the wall. What an upgrade from the KN44. Holy shit. There we go. And that is the first teleporter done. Oh yeah, I forgot dogs are a thing on the fucking giant. I forget dogs are a thing in BO3 a lot of the time actually because all I play is custom maps. Go, there's a max ammo. Got to reload because we are on BO3. Well, BO2, BO3. You get what I mean. I think we are just going to pack the PDW here, but uh, I need to see first, because I don't know if I'm going to hit the box here. I don't even know if it's going to be worth it. Bro, there's a fridge on this map? What the fuck? Does it work? Bro, it works as well. What? And hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Could you always buy speed cooler through this wall? <laughs> right, we need to grab Jug ASAP, bro. Let's use some M1911 ammo here, because it's always good to rack up some extra points. Ah, fuck, there's a nuke up there, right? That's going to be a cheeky 400 if we can run back up, grab it. Right, let's grab this nuke here, and I think we're going to go grab Jug next, then we'll get the rest of the teleporters on, because we are playing BO2 here. Could you guys imagine if Durris was remastered on BO2? That would have been fucking crazy. I think that would have marked it as the most remastered map ever. I think the most remastered map ever is definitely Nocturne and Totem because it's been in literally, I think, every game. We have ran out of ammo for the PDW and there was still a shit ton of zombies. Hang on, we gotta find another gun here. Oh my god. Or, alternatively, we could just buy some more ammo because this thing has a lot. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. Okay, we got a nice little double points there. It's probably gonna run out before the round starts, to tell you the truth. But, we're gonna go link ZB, which is the second teleport. That is also the Tommy gun on the wall there. We'll need to clock. And there we go. There's the second one done. We've just got to do the third one now. And once that's done, all we need to pack a bunch of weapon. And then we're pretty much done. This one's really short and sweet. That's why I kind of like the giant so much, because it's so simple, but it gets quite boring if you're like an experienced player. In my opinion, anyway. Well, that's mainly a bit here, because we could get some serious points. And there we go. We just racked up nearly seven grand from just knife. And what a great insta kill. We should have enough to pack a bunch of gun, actually, I think, if we uh, if we're quick here. Not going to open the door that actually leads back down because I feel like it's just a waste of money. You can still loop around and make it, so. Yeah, you just about make it with, like, 10 seconds to spare. And there we go. Let's get this PDW in that pack-a-punch machine. And there we go. Wow, that looks good. Holy fuck, they even coded, like, the custom camo for it. Maybe that's not custom, actually. It might just be, like, you know, the BO3 camo slapped onto the weapon texture, but it looks good nonetheless. Okay, we are getting backed into a corner here a little bit. Let's just, uh, let's grab this nuke here. And I think we should open this door just for the sake of, this, just for the sake of being quick. And then and shoot this. There we go. That starts a flytrap easter egg. This takes about five fucking minutes. There we go. There's the first one. There's a little monkey bomb in there. And there we go. That's a maximum for the dog round. And the other two little teddy bears and shit that you have to shoot. There's one up here. There. Uh, what? There. There we go. And the final one, I think, is in this vat here. Yeah, there we go. And with that, there we go. We have completed the giant's easter egg. There's only one thing left to do now, and that is hold the grenade for longer than four seconds. I need to find some lead or I'm gonna get bored here! Okay, welcome to Derizon Drac with Black Ops 2 weapons. Holy fuck. Okay, this looks good. 
with. You'll notice that the mod looks a little bit different because it's not the same mod. It doesn't actually work with the Ryzen Drac. I've tried getting it to work, but I did find this alternative on the Steam Workshop and it looks just as fine. The only difference is that the HUD looks a bit different and the health system is back to the usual three hit for Black Ops 3 and the Gobble Gun machines are about, but we're just not going to use the symbol. It'll be like this for GK and Rev, but Zetable should be fine. Let's grab ourselves a Tram Fuse power up here. Please be a double points. I am begging you. It's one of the best ones you can get. Ah, max ammo. Okay, right. That's not terrible. Grab an M14 off the wall here. I won't lie to you. I've played like two other games at DE before this. I, it's not failed attempts. I've just been too paranoid whether or not I've been playing on a ranked game or not. Because if you're not playing on a ranked game on DE, you have to do all four bows. And I still to this day do not know how to do the void bow. Feel free to slate me in the comments if you really want to. But yeah, no, I'd say this mod looks pretty good. It's actually captured some of the like the good elements about BO2, like, you know, like the guns and shit and all that. But no HUD, no two hit system. I'm sorry, but it's just going to have to stay like that for a couple of the um, BO3 original maps. I'm going to try end the round before that nuke goes away because that could be a very nice bonus 400 points here. Never mind. Let's just use our M1911 here to get some extra bonus points. Okay, there we go. Right. 3.6k is not bad for round four. So I think we're going to go with the first dragon now and sort these zombies out because I want to get the bow as soon as possible. Oh my God, it's not round three. Oh my God, I'm red screen. Whoa, bro, how was he a four knife on round three? Three. Okay, that might be the stupidest down we've had yet. Whatever. 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 I guess I won't be point conservative. No, no, no. None of that for me, I guess. Grab this shield piece. Let's not die. Oh my fucking god. Right. Get that headshot. Another max ammo for my fucking M14 and M1911. Sure. You know what would have been nice? A double points. But no. Okay, just as long as we get this first dragon head filled up before round four ends, I will be a happy chappy. I think that's his fifth zombie now. We should be nearly there. I think it's eight zombies it takes per dragon head. Okay, he's done. Right, let's squeeze the Ramina Put the remaining the remaining points we can out of these zombies with my M1911, and then we'll go turn power on because we've got more than enough points to do so. Oh my god! Right, I'm gonna go quickly grab qu quick revive because I do not want to go down and lose all my progress because this is the one run that I know was gonna work 100%. I'm also very good at the DE Easter egg. I like the thing as well, so I guarantee we won't DNF on this one like we did on Shadows of Evil. That was ridiculous though. We were basically up to the last step. Well, the last step that we could complete anyway. Let's grab an MP40 off the wall here. Let's go through here. We still have enough to get uh, reach pa power here. That power switch turned on, and let's go fill up the second dog head. Yeah, the second dog head. Turn on this wonder sphere pad thing, whatever the fuck. Um, shield piece is not up here. Shield piece is not there, so it has to be there. All right, cool. And that is the dog round over. And with that, and with that, there should be some more zombie spawns. You know, like the good stuff. You know, the ones that we need for the dragon head. Blah blah blah. Totally didn't do that on purpose, bro. Totally didn't do the disco Easter egg on purpose. Who would ever do that? I can't believe this was found fucking accidentally. That's a kind of crazy. It was the fucking Cold War coffin dance easter egg before it's time. Okay, we're gonna use my M1911 a lot here, actually, because it is a double point and there's a horde over there, so we're gonna get loads of penetration points. Also gonna have to be careful not to die, you know, that's that's another thing. Kill off a couple of these zombies, because there's far too many, and they're gonna despawn anywhere when we go downstairs. Fine. Tram fuse. Okay, that should be his last one. I'm not too sure. Might be one more. One more. Totally 100% didn't go down there. I don't know what you guys are on about. I'm just the best zombies player ever. Ignore them two downs. Yeah, 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 it's fine. We only need one for the boss fight anyway. Don't worry about it. Grab some Jug here, and let's go grab our last quick revive already. I feel ashamed of myself. Once we get the bow, though, we should be sorted. I feel like the spawns, man, are just so fucking jank when you install mods. I don't know what it is about it. I might, it might honestly just be placebo effect, but I'm not sure. Why does the AN suck on BO3? What is this? Once we've got the bow, it is basically a clear shot to the wisp steps. It's literally just how fast can I shoot the things. I fire one bullet into that horde, half of it fucking dies because it insta kill. Thank you very much, game. Giving me the wrong power-ups at all the right times or the other way around apparently i can't english today i'm struggling to speak a lot today and i don't know why i think i'm really tired from college and i've banged out two easter like two easter eggs like the giant and soe in one fucking day and i think i'm just exhausted but you know what that content grind never stops bro okay he's done right you can all die now bye bye give me that max ammo right let's go get this electric bow started up for the third time today yep this is my third attempt recording this because i'm a fucking idiot there's a broken arrow haha -ha, rustman reference and we have our bow now so things are a a lot easier. There's one. I think I shot too low on that. Yeah, I did. Okay. There's two. Very nice. And we need to get ourselves down to rocket test to do number three. I also want to see where the shield 
pieces just so I know what to grab it when we come back up here to do the uh, the second step of the lightning bow. It's there. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And away we go. There we go. First try. Very nice. Oh, let's, take a let's teleport these Pack-a-Punch pieces because, you know, we kind of need to get the Pack-a-Punch upstairs. That was the whole thing of not teleporting them upstairs, blah, blah, blah. You get what I'm trying to say. I still can't believe we've went down fucking twice, man. And we've lost, like, all three of our quick revives. That is so sad. Right, we can grab the shield piece once we're up there with the anti-grab. There's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. Uh, jump to five. <laughs> that was perfect. Nice one. Right, okay, let's grab the shield piece too. Let's go build that shit upstairs. Okay, shield acquired. That is very nice for doing the other steps. Uh, I want to end the round now as soon as possible, mainly because we need souls and we don't have enough zombies just kicking about four to fill up these urns. Well, we probably did now that I think about it and I'm seeing the amount of zombies that were on my screen, but I couldn't give a fuck. I'm not a speedrunner and I'm not trying to do this as early as possible. I don't care. Okay, there's one, two, three. Don't know how many souls that was, but it's, oh, well, it's definitely enough now. Oh, that could have, I was so close, man. That's a joke. I hate how this one's just in a fucking doorway so they can just come out and block you like that. It's so annoying. That should be it, hopefully. Yes, nice. Oh, I didn't turn on the Wonder Sphere. What the fuck is wrong with me? We're going to grab stamina up as well for the Wisp Step because it's always just nice to have around so you can get around the map quicker. Right, okay, round 10. Got to do this one and then jump over and shoot it and then we got to go back down to Rocket Test and do the other one. Bro, we're so organized. I love DE so much, man. This is 100% my map, bro. We are finishing the Easter Egg on this one. I'm saying that as if we didn't finish the Giant, but the Giant doesn't even, it's not even a fucking Easter Egg. That makes things a whole lot easier. Okay, that's that filled thanks to the insta-kill and that rhymed. I'm a poet and I didn't know it. Right, okay, let me jump over here and quickly just shoot this one. There we go. Almost missed it, but almost. Not quite, which is a good thing. Right, let's get our asses over to Rocket Test and do this final one. Then we are good as golden to start the Easter Egg, pretty much. Okay, very, very nice. And all we have to do now is just shoot this thing here. Ah, fuck. I cannot believe we missed that. How did we miss again? Bro, bro I'm so arse at this game. Right, okay, let's get this round ended nice and quick here. Right, nice one. Let's get the fuck out of here. I think what I'm going to do now, actually, I think I'm going to pack this fucking AN94, whatever I'm using here, and turn it into whatever the fuck this thing is. We need to go up and grab our arrow really quick, and then we can actually start the Easter egg. Also, I feel like the packed AN is just like, he's a la fucking a la mode or whatever the French say. <laughs> Putting through these zombies like fucking butter, man. Holy. Okay, now all we've got to do is quickly run down to the box down here and shot our arrow in there, and then we take the Wrath of the Ancients back out, shoot the teleporter prongs, and we are onto the Wisp Step. 20 minutes in, by the way. We're doing quite well. I'm surprised that wasn't it, to be fair. We killed fucking loads there, like 13 zombies. Okay, that's Panzer. That's fine, I guess. We uh, we need him anyway for fucking the Ragnarok part. We do need to go back to Rocket Test and grab that in a bit. Here he is. Right, okay, there's Panzer down. That is more than fine. I think our arrow's done. No, it's not. We do have a Ragnarok piece now, though. Surely we're nearly done. Come on. Right, there we go. Stick that in there, and then it's onto the Wisps. Bink, bink, bonk. It's not clock. It's not there. That means they're going to be really fucking far away. That's annoying. It's not barracks, so yeah, it's definitely one of the further locations. I'm guessing phone. No phone. Fuck. It's not globe. So it's either going to be car or quick, right? Or the, the weird one up here. Could actually be the weird one up here, to be fair with you. Oh, it is. All right, nice one. It's not phone. Okay, so we're going to go back through here and check barracks and stuff. I never have it land on barracks. I don't know why. It's not clock, is it? The one down there? Could have sworn I seen that thing light up, but okay. It's car. Nice. Quick revive. Very fucking nice. Okay, that was nice timing. Uh, oh, barracks. I never have it go here. I think we've got one more to hit and then we're done. Oh, no, we're done now. Okay. Right, not bad. Not bad at all. Right, let's go grab the fucking tubes or whatever and the fuses, I think, and then we're done. This step, at least. Right, let's grab these fuses. Let's grab this pipe and let's watch the fucking code. Our code is ODO. I've never had it have that before. Uh, well, I've, actually, that's a lie. I've probably had that in the past, but what I'm trying to say is that I haven't seen it in a while. It's gonna be a panzer that drops down here. Bro, this map is so predictable when you've done it like a billion times. Right, that's rocket test going off. That'll probably end the round if it doesn't kill the zombie. I don't know. It might. I don't know. Right. Okay. We have the fuses now, meaning we can switch this from destroy to protect or the other way around. I can never remember. It doesn't really matter. And then run. Oh, the. Oh, very nice. Okay. Let's go grab our floppy disk or milk bottles. I think it's called in the Mr. Ruffle Waffles tutorial. All right. Nice. We've got them now. And then we can go up here. Flick this back to what is it actually? Destroy. Okay. Put these two fuckers in, and then we're done. Now it's on to Simon Says.
D O up R. D O up L, sorry. D O up L. D O up L. D. D O up L. D O. I have a memory of a goldfish, so this just helps. D O up. D O. O again. O again, bro. This isn't difficult. D. Okay, that's that one. That's that one done. Very nice. We haven't turned on that, so we're gonna have to go back down and use the teleporter, but that's fine. Did that one light up? Let me just double check. Yeah, lit up. Right, okay. Cool, cool, cool. I think Rocket Test just went off as well, so we should be like home stretch to doing this. Right, okay. Second terminal. L up O D. L up O D. O L D up D L L again. Up. Oh, right, that's that. Holy shit, that did not take long, and both of them are on. Bro, the amount of stuff that's rhyming in this playthrough. Can I stop? Okay, let's bring Dempsey home, shall we? There he is. Bro, it, it's, it just baffles us how this is just a thing in zombies. We went from sitting in a bunker in 2008 to watching a rocket fly into the fucking map and do this. That's still insane to me, bro. Right, okay, let's flick on the death ray here because I need to go and grab my Ragnarok part here. We also need to go back down to rocket test and get the one off there. I suppose we could do wisps now, actually, as well. I mean, Ragnaroks aren't really that important up until when we really want to go into the boss fight, so I guess we'll do it now. Oh, shit, yeah, pick up the drill device, and there will be a wisp probably on the phone. It hasn't been there yet, so I'd imagine it probably be there. Ah, shit, we should probably grab that piece, too. It's not on phone. Okay, fuck the Ragnaroks for now. We'll get them later. Okay, it's on globe. That's fine. It's not there. That would have been sick if it was, though. It's not car. Could be quick revive. Although, I heavily doubt it. No, it's not there. Okay. Is it on the clock? No. Is it there? Yes. Funnily enough, it was there again. So, there we go. There's that one. And I am guessing the last one's either going to be phone or the weird place. Oh, it's barracks. Okay. Weird. I literally never, ever get barracks on my playthroughs. Okay. Now, we need to go back and grab the tablet. And then, we can start the bow step. And then, we can go do the Ragnaroks last. I don't, I don't know why I've done the Ragnaroks last. This is, oh, this is really weird. And there's the only thing we needed from here. Fucking Panzer, man. You're the easiest boss known to man. Well, on this map anyway, at least. Origins, he's fucking terrifying. Right. Yep, yeah, that new rocket test would go off as well. Right, okay, it's fine. Right, there we go. Activate the switch. Bro, I, I hate how the Rising Drag is just, like, permanently ingrained into my mind, the amount I used to play it, like, back in the day. It's the only map in BO3 where I can... I don't have to look up a single guide for it. It's crazy. Pull that, grab the part, and the only one we need now is off the Ragnaroks. Not the Ragnaroks, sorry, the Death Ray. Right, okay. For the third time, let's actually do this piece. I'm just gonna wait here and then we've got the sky. Pretty selfish planet. That's what I've been trying to do for like the past fucking hour now. But I keep getting sidetracked by different shit. Right, okay, what one is it? Uh, that one. It's the one over here, right? And we now have all the pieces for the Ragnaroks, and let's just for shits and gigs build them here. We'll need to pick them up. We'll need to pick them up once anyway, so it's fine. And now we can go spawn in the Keeper. Bro, we've speed ran this Easter egg. Okay, let's shot this in here. All right, where's he going first? Okay, he's going downstairs first. Cringe. And now the dogs start to spawn. Yeah, I was wondering where they are for the Simon Says step. No way he goes to the fucking broken one first. I've never had this before. Just breathe a sigh of relief there, just realizing that, yeah, I didn't fuck up with, like, you know, like, hosting the game on unranked or offline or whatever. It's fine. It's fine to worry about it. For the first time in a while, I actually don't know what gun to bring into the fucking boss fight, because the Remington, for all I remember, is absolute arse. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna get double tap 2 instead of speed cooler, because we don't really need it for the boss fight, in my opinion. I can never remember if this system is based off of souls or amount of time spent here, because sometimes it's, like, either or. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna grab double tap really quick here. Right, okay. Yeah, it, it must be rounds, man. That's too coincidental for it not. Okay, it's this one. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh my god, that was a little bit embarrassing. Fucking dogs lunging out of nowhere, bro. Okay, we gotta be careful. My shield is broke. That is a max ammo. That's perfect. Yeah, it's gotta be rounds, man. That's far too coincidental. Is he going down here? Where's he going? Where's he going? Right, he's going, he's going up. Okay. Where's his panzer spawning in that, bro? Going to AN94 with its name on it. Can we double pack? We can double pack. Okay. Dead wire. Absolutely perfect. Okay, that thing absolutely destroys the panzer. That should be great for the boss fight. Insta kill. Always obliged. It baffles me how people say they prefer the wolf bow to the electric bow. Like, bro, what the fuck? Like, you can't do this shit with the wolf bow. Okay, we've got one more area to do, and it's the little one next to the crow. You know, like, remember that fucking easter egg that everyone was raving about? You know, the crow that kind of sits up there and you can shoot? And everyone thought it was just, like, amazing side quest, but in reality, it was just, like, a little thing that they put in. Fucking zombies fans when they notice a detail, like, ten years earlier. Right, okay, this is officially the last step before the boss fight. I am a little bit nervous. I've never done the boss fight without Mega Gobble Gums in, I actually think, years. We're talking like back in the console days when I couldn't afford that shit. Okay, perfect. Bro, have I got fucking, what's it called? Power vacuum on or some shit? 
that's another insta kill on the ground. Okay, and that is that. Yeah, it has to be round based, man. That was the fastest one I've done yet, and it was because I had a nuke. Honestly, round 20, not half bad. Could have been a whole lot worse. And there we go. Very, very nice. Gonna run upstairs quick and grab a shield, and I'm saying we just get jump straight into this. No point in waiting around. Right, okay, now we gotta fucking put this new canister in, and there we go. Right, okay, we get a max ammo when we go in there, so I'm saying we just jump straight in. We got a fresh shield, we're good to go. Okay, here we go. Not done this for a while. It has been fucking years. Without mega gobble gums, of course. Or like fucking a Dagon's glare that makes it ten times easier with the panzers. But you know, it's fine. It's fine. Part of the challenge. I won't lie, my heart does always go a little bit faster whenever we, whenever I do this. It's just like, I don't know, it's a bit of a mix of nostalgia and just like actual fear of fucking it up. Alright, there we go. We almost just went down there. That was fucking bad, bad. Alright, okay, protect myself and then just tap fire into his chest. And there we go. Right, cool, 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 cool. A max ammo would be really nice, I can't lie. Yep, thank you very much. Right, we've just got to charge up our uh, Ragnaroks now. So let's refresh from using the bow because you do get carried away when you start using it right first round of panzers this is fine bro the no dagon's glare is fucking hitting different man Oh, it's fine. I'm going to spam the fucking bow. It's fine. We're getting a max ammo anyway. Doesn't matter. Right, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Grab the max ammo. Right, our Ragnaroks are nearly charged. Right, there we go. They're charged. Right, we should be good for another attack here. Right, okay. Shot them down. Run back here. Go, go, go. Right, there we go. There, we're on the phase three now. Just got to be wary of the pandas, and we should be good to go. Right, I, I always used to struggle with this bit on console, so I am ultra focused right now, bro. It's ridiculous. I still suck at this boss fight, I can't lie. I know the whole, like, oh, run anti-clockwise thing, but that's literally about it. Also, sh who thought it'd be a good idea to give the Panzer shock charges, man? Like, actually, fuck off. It's nice that you do get a lot of max ammos for doing this, though. Who actually thought it'd be a good idea to give them shock charges, man? Actually bring back the claw. I'd rather the fucking claw. I'm convinced this is why they gave them fucking shock charges, purely because it wouldn't work in the boss fight. Actually, that does make a lot of sense. I've just brainstormed that out of the spot. I can't lie. I was chatting out my ass. Okay, there we go. That should be it, hopefully. I can't remember if there's another round of Panzers. I think there is. Oh, no, we're good. We are good. Okay, we're just waiting for the last strike here. Should come up any second now, hopefully. It's the most annoying thing where you actually run into the fucking keeper. Okay, there we go. Plant that down. Right, he's this way. Oh my god, did we do it? Did we do it? Did we do it? Did we do it? Did we... Please, 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 please tell me we did it. Please tell me we did it. Holy fuck. Yes! The rising track done. Let's go. BO2 weapons. Oh, I'm so proud. And there we fucking go, bro. Right, let's go end this shit. If we can get our... we can get ourselves off to the island of Division 9. Zetsubo no Shima. I have not done that Easter egg in a while, but we'll give it a go. But for now, we finish. Genuinely lit, like actually the coolest cutscene next to Moon. It's not even a cutscene, it's like the mini cutscene before the story, but it's just cool. Drop the chips and get me some ammo! Okay, DLC 2, here we are, ZNS. We have got double down arrow for the first skull. We have got the bucket right here, and we are using Mega Gobble Gums because I am sick of failing this Easter egg. I shit you not, this is my 10th attempt at doing this. All right, bless me up with that Perkaholic, please. Thank you very much. Literally just gonna try and clear this round as fast as possible. It feels so nice to be able to run this quick on round one. Also, we have PhD. That's odd. That was shopping free, and there we go. We're off. Alright, okay. Get that open. Get that open. Get this open. Get that open. This one too. I'm gonna grab a weapon off the wall here. It is the MP7. Okay. Get this one open. Get this one open. Now we can quickly run back through spawn if we're fast and get that open too. Oh my god, hurry up. Right there, there's that. And this... Oh, we're gonna make it. We're we gonna make it. We're we gonna make it. Yeah, we fucking made it. Let's go. We got literally the entire map open minus the bunker. Okay. Right, let's have a look at these challenges then. We've got use a sport to regain air. Look at that. Use a spore to regain air underwater. Kill 20 zombies while underwater. Kill eight spiders with spores. Bro, they are so easy. Okay, we need the double down skull. We need this one. Alright, okay. I feel like we can get some proper momentum going here. Okay, right. Let's get this skull set down just here. Then once we've done this, we'll go do the other skull opposite, just over there. Is it there? Yeah, just over there. And then we'll go about grabbing pieces and stuff. This fucking MP7 is rapid. Come on, it should be done by now. There we go. All right, give me that skull. All right, okay, let's slap that down there. And, right, we need to go see what other skull we need to do, which is, like, to the opposite of this one. I don't mean to kill these zombies with PhD. That's doing my head in. I feel like that's gonna end up doing my head in for a lot of things. Kinda regretting putting on Perkaholic now, but, you know, hey-ho, I'm sick of failing this map. Okay, what one's this? Oh, yeah, that as well. That's gonna be annoying. It's 3, 2, 1. Okay. Like I said, we'll do this skull, then we'll go about searching for all the pieces for all the stuff, because we do need to do that. The shield and the gas mask is like utmost importance. Pack a punch, not so much really. We could do that as we go. It was three, two, one. Slap that down there. There we go. I am noticing as well that this 
mod actually spawns in a lot of like little power-ups, like Vulturid power-ups, but we don't have Vulturid. It's kind of weird. Okay, there's a seed. We do need that. Ah, oh, shit. We ran out of ammo. Okay. That thing is absolutely rapid, though. We need to find a gun. Is there a gun in here? Yeah, there Oh, wait. Never mind. There's ammo on the floor. It's fine. All right. Okay, the skull's done anyway. Set that one down. Then we'll just grab a random one here because we don't know which one's going to be on the opposite side. And I think now I'm going to go and run about and look for shield pieces and gas mask pieces. I think the first one can be here. Here? It's not there. Okay. It's on they literally the furthest one away. Oh, I didn't mean to go underwater there. It is right here. That PhD is absolutely lethal, by the way. There's our shield piece as well. And let's get this generator filled up. Now we can go run over to the opposite side and do the second generator. Then we can get a lot of doors open, actually. Right, okay. The second shield piece is here, too. It can be in a bunch of different locations. Oh, it's in the weird one that I can never find. I oh, will find a layer. Right, now my priority is just getting this on. Oh, fuck. I need water. Grab some of that irradiated water. And there we go. That is our temporary power on and we can go now dash over to the bunker and we've got it open there we go nice you know what it is honestly i don't like zns but that is one of the coolest fucking things ever the whole bunker system right, okay let's go for the power room here we'll get this on and then we'll go do some other shit we still need to grab that shield piece i completely just ran away from it sure i'll take a ksg it's one of the best shotguns i've ever used right there we go there's our power piece and for some reason it just doesn't like you like grabbing it before this is expired like come on spell all the water let me grab my piece right thank you there we go right let's get the main power are on and that is that sorted right, let's see here it is this skull as well nice okay there's a thrasher spawning in that's no match for my fucking ksg okay there's another gas mask piece there i can never say gas mask like correctly i don't know why ksg is tearing it up man bro why do they keep spawning in holy right, okay it's done anyway right thank you for my cleansed skull and now we just need to go do the one opposite to this let's get this door open grab the shield piece i think that's everything that's there really we can also grab the shield piece over here but i can never remember where this thing is in its third location I always fuck this up. There it is. Okay, right. It's around the corner. Cool, cool, cool. Right. Is there anything we could be doing right now? We could go get the third gas mask piece. And there's another thrasher, bro. Go away. Okay, let's set this skull down here. And we'll also grab this one. We can run back this direction as well and grab the little, like, string piece for the uh, the gas mask. And we should probably also get them built. Because, like, what's using by getting all three parts and just not building it? And there it is. Cool. String piece. Thank you very much. I swear there's a buildable table in here. And we're going to build the gas mask in this one. And then the shield at Gen A. Yeah, gas mask do this one there we go and i'm sure of it that there's a buildable table in here too oh i might be really mistaken i'm not sure no there's a bit that there is a buildable table in here cool right okay we have the shield now too that is amazing right we really just need to end this round because we kind of need spiders for the kt4 now we also need to kill spiders as part of our challenge so we'll get that done as well and let's plonk down the final skull here and then we'll grab the skull and on sapway any other day i would have opened the other door to go down into the operations bunker to get the last pack a punch piece but because we're doing the easter egg i'm kind of prioritizing and getting this done as fast as possible. I want this spider to come over here because we can get we can get part of our challenge done if, it, if he comes over to this spore just here. Alright, there's one. Alright, there's two, three. Okay, we got a few there just before the spider round as well. That's nice. Oh, it's not spider round. That must be round six. Okay, weird. Right, let's go get the skull done then. In fact, actually, fuck the skull for now. We're gonna go back down into here and open up the mine shaft area so we can get some more challenges done. And grab the KT4 part. Alright, there we go. There's one challenge. We can kill two birds with one stone here because the other one was kill 20 zombies underwater. So what we'll do is we'll just chill in here for a little bit. Possibly end the round and maybe go into round six. I don't know. Right, okay, thank you. Grab some air here. Kill 20 zombies while underwater. That was really fucking fast. All right, all we've got to do now is kill spiders. We also do need spiders for the KT4 piece as well. We're with you one. So we're going to have to look for a spore and then save one. Also going to grab the final Pack-A-Punch piece here. It is just in these body bags. There's the last piece and now we can go open Pack-A-Punch. Bro, we are on top of everything. Holy. One, two, and three. Sick. Before the end of the round, I'm going to go do the skull and then we can do the spider bit. But we're doing so well. How many more spiders have we got to kill? That looks like five. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Start this ritual here. Do you know what it is? This is probably one of the coolest ways to get the specialist weapon. Like a fucking a skull on an altar being protected by mythical beings is just so cool to me. All right, there we go. Thank you for my specialist weapon. That shit away. And we'll go do the poster now as well. Lovely. Now we'd, I just kind of want to flip the round because we need to get this spider round so we can start on the KT4. Also going to try and hit for anywhere but here. That's not anywhere but here, unfortunately. Because that means we can just grab the first gear as well. Okay, that could possibly be anywhere but here. It is. Cool. Right, we'll do that in a sec. Oh, wait, shit. It's not spider round. We'll just do that now. Okay, very cool. That's the first gear done. Kind of just need to fill up our uh, skull here and end the round. Okay, let's get this little door open here as well. Nice. 
Right, okay, hopefully it should be spider around now so we can do the little vial thing for the KT4 and then we can just have to wait it out for the other bit. Then we can do spider boss fight, which is one of the easiest things ever. Okay, that's spiders. Cool, cool, cool. Gonna throw my, my Widow's Point grenades just quickly here. Also need to stop sliding so I'm gonna end up killing too many and we do need them for spores. All right, get one in here. Off you go. Bring them up and let this needle thing do its work. There we go. Nice one. Right, let's go find some spores now and then hopefully this should be enough spiders to end the, uh, the challenge that we're trying to do. All right, there's one just here. That's perfect. Come on. All right, okay. There's another big spore in here. We can use this one. Okay, unfortunately, that wasn't enough to do the challenge, but I think we're literally, like, one off. Yeah, we are. That's so unfortunate. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We can do so much until then. Once this guy comes with the green vial, we can go to the spider boss fight, and then we can grab the tooth for the Masamune, and then, you know, just... We're keeping the ball rolling, man. We're doing good. I can't remember yet if we can get grab the rainbow water, but I might go give it a go, because we're probably going to want to start on that. Okay, here's the service tunnel. All right, let's give it a go. Okay, I need to make sure I can actually grab this. Okay, we got it. Nice, 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 nice. Right, now we can start on the plant for the Masamune as well. See, bro, we are so on top right now. Still waiting on my man for the KT4 piece, though. Where, where's that at? Where's that at? And he was just there. There we go. Right, let's go get the KT4 built now. Round nine, and we've already got all this done, bro. We're doing amazing. Okay, slap that in there. Make my gun green and make it powerful. Swap this out for the M1911, so we know it's not the mule kick weapon. And let's head down here and go do this piece, because we kind of need to. Thank you for the air. Cool. Plant that and give it a quick water. There we go. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. Can we just anywhere but here? Oh, we can. Right, that's clever. We are going to need to head back down there next round, but I'm going to wait it out just a little bit because I want them spores to regrow because my breath, I was fearing for my life down there. Actually, what we're going to go do now before we end the round is I'm going to go pack a punch this MP7 and we're going to go do the spider boss. So we can again grab the tooth for the Masamune, get that shit upgraded, then we're good as golden. Get that in the pack a punch machine. Tommy's micro penis. Nice name. Okay, let's give these webs a quick shoot with the KT4. They disappear, and now it's boss fight time. Oh, no, wait, wait, go down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably the easiest boss fight ever to exist. Bro, that plane is so loud. There we go. That's phase one done. Right, this is what I mean by the MP7 is absolutely rapid on this mod. Right, there's phase two done. Oh, my God, bro, this is ridiculous. And there we go. She's dead. Wow, that was fucking painless. Thank you for the tooth. And we are out of here. Right, we've got to go water that plant again. Right, it's not spider around yet, which is fine. This is definitely the most tedious part about Zetable. The whole plant system, it's so fucking dead, man. I don't want to look after this shitty plant for, like, the rest of my life, bro. Come on. You know, Death Machine, that just makes everything ten times easier. Cheers, pal. I'm going to throw these grenades away, actually, because I don't want that spore to pop down there, because we do really need that one. All right, there we go. Get that nice and watered. Grab some air. There's a thrasher in the fucking water. Okay. Ridiculous how easy that boss actually is, man. I think next round it should actually be spiders. So this round, hopefully. Might be round 12. I don't know, though. If so, then we can literally get everything else done, and we can just go boss fight. No, it's not. Okay. Well, that was a little bit too good to be true. Okay, whatever. Ah, oh, bro. We've got to go back down there and water it one more time. Fuck's sake. Thank you for the water. I mean, fucking air. Why? I don't want water, bro. I'll die. I'm not a fish. All right, hurry up. Right, there we go. Grab the air. And hopefully when we go back down there next round after we kill the spiders, that plant should be sitting there waiting for us. I think we are just going to chill here so I can just go and grab the plant before the spiders start coming. This MP7 might actually be the best gun I've ever used, bro. Okay, there's spiders. And there is a giant spore here. So that's what we're going to kill our only one we've got left to do with. Come on, where you at? Come here. There we go. Right, that's all the challenges done now. Perfect. Right, let's quickly run down here and grab this Masamune plant. Should be done by now, I think. Right, there we go. Give me that shit. Right, I'm going back up. Right, now what's left to do on the agenda? I need to grab the electricity off the shield and then grab the little vial of liquid divinium and then upgrade the KT4 and then we just need to do the last two gears. So I'm going to go do that now, actually, because we still have a really fucking good strength shield. So I'm going to go grab some electricity off of it. Now all we've got to do is just wait for lightning and this can take fucking four minutes it's a four years, bro. There's no in between. Right, there we go. Electric shield. Now we can run over to this generator here and bash the console and lower ourselves down into this fucking cage. Before I do that, though, I'm going to end the round. So this spider needs to rip and come down here. Grab the max ammo. And now I'm pretty sure all you do now is you just bash this cage, get lowered down into the bit below, and then you come back up. So, yep, like that. And then now we get in instead of the fucking spider. Oh, this is weird. I don't like it. Right, where's the skeleton? Take the vial of liquid divinium. Right, okay. Thank you. Very cool, Mr. Game. Let me, bro, let me move, holy. Right, let's go upgrade this into the Masamune, and then we've got a fully upgraded KT4, and we're ready to basically boss fight as soon as we get the other two gears. Right, okay, let's turn this into the Masamune. Thank you, very cool. Right, now to do the bit that scares literally everybody and their mom. I've got to go down to the fucking zip line and, you know, time it right, hopefully, and not fall off. I'm that paranoid, I might actually grab a self-med. That's not self-med, that's Ram Robin, bro, come on. That's still good to have about, but not when we're about to fucking die, probably. We'll need that for this next step. 
up actually because we need to grow the uh, bullet for the third gear. I do need this lightning strike to come fast though because I want to get this done as soon as possible. Right, there we go. Bro, I'm actually nervous I won't lie to do this step. It actually, it, it's so scary. Holy fuck. I really want a self med, man. It'll make me feel so better. That's a perkaholic. Come on. Okay, that's self med. Cool, 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 cool. Right, okay, I'll be lying to you if I didn't say I was terrified. I missed it. Fuck. <laughs> Now we're gonna go wait for a lightning strike. Okay, cool. Okay, I'm an absolute idiot and forgot to re unpause my recording just to make sure I could get that first try. Well, second try, but we did get it. I apologize for that. So if we put both of these, yeah, see, we've got two gears now. We just need to grow the plant. Okay, so now we need to go grab some blue water and we need to go water a plant until it grows a fucking bullet because this is how this island works, apparently. Grab another gas mask here before we do anything. There's another thrasher. Oh, hi. Hi, yeah, you, you all right, pal? You all right? Literally no match for me. Grab some blue water here. We can Fuck off the rainbow water because we actually don't need that now. And there's the plane that we can finally fucking shoot down so we can stop making this annoying ass noise. Apparently, you gotta charge this up, water it, and then shoot it like that. And it looks like that works because it's glowing a different color now. Okay, a round robin would probably be really useful here. Okay, let's give it another dose of the water here and let's charge up this shot. We're gonna do that for like another two rounds and then we're done. Right, I'm gonna see if I can grab a round robin before we do anything here. Oh, I think that's it. Yeah, <laughs> let's go. Get some water and then shoot. Spider round as well. That works out. I'm gonna grab a boy knife for shits and giggles here. Okay, that round went by fucking fast. Holy. All right, please. Please have my bullet in it. Come on. You are joking, bro. Okay, I guess we'll give it another go because apparently that just didn't work. It's fine, though. We move. Oh, can this thrasher piss off, man? Bro, come on. I thought I killed you. Piss off. You're not big. You're not scary. You're not nothing, little bro. Plant that down and then we'll charge up our shot here. Water it. Shoot. Right, now we're going to grab this nuke here, which is conveniently placed. Hopefully that should end the round. There's literally nothing else we can be doing now we've literally just gotta wait for this okay let's give it another dose of the water here i'm gonna charge up my shot preemptively i hope that god it gives us the bullet this time because this could go on to like round 30 bro right okay well, i think we're gonna use this shot and free to try again another round robin out the gobble gun machine here because it'll just speed everything up really that's anywhere but here i don't want that self-med i still don't want that okay right we're gonna go water it anyway again i hate how this is completely rng like rng should not be like an easter egg step kind of thing it's the exact same why i don't like the moon easter egg right there we go we've upgraded it three times it's guaranteed to give us a high tier reward but it's a shame the high tier rewards consist of like the bullet and like seven other things okay that is round robin right we're gonna pop it now just because you know we can and also this better give me the fucking bullet i swear to god come on oh, a perk bottle why are you doing me like this all right okay let's try it again bro this is like fucking that guy who pushed the rock uphill i can't remember his name fucking sisyphus i can't remember his name <laughs> literally how i'm feeling right now one must imagine sisyphus grown as that's a bunushi my bullet plant right, okay that's glowing green again that is literally what we we need to try get another round robin here because we're literally just trying to get through the rounds at this point anywhere but here not the right um gobble gun but the right color had me excited there can perkaholic man come on right okay let's go water this shit again right it's growing it's glowing green that is what we want right okay that's that round done we've just got one more round to do right okay cool 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 hopefully we can get a round robin now it'd be really nice no we're getting another shopping free okay i don't even mind that we do have 20 fucking six of them round robin perfect right come on please please why you gotta do me like this, man? Come on. Chat, it's time. I finally grew the fucking bullet. Let's go. I keep saying chat like I'm live. It's just habit now, bro. I'm gonna wait till the end of the round because I really don't want to fuck this up because the zombie spawns. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna kill. I'm just gonna leave one, I think. Right, okay. Now all we have to do is play the waiting game. There we go, chat. Oh my god, let's go. Fuck yes. Oh my god, we're so close to being done. It's ridiculous. Right, now we just need to grab this final gear and then it's boss fight time. Okay, now that we've shot the plane down, I can't remember if I unpaused my recording. I apologize if I didn't. We just need to grab this last gear and then we're basically ready to go. And there's the final gear. Okay, right. I'm going to go double pack my weapons and then we're off the boss fight. Right, I'm going to pack my weapon here. Let's give it a quick double pack and fireworks. That'll do. And let's put this final gear in. And there we go. Oh my god. Okay, it's boss fight time. It's Oh, I'm so ready. Actually, wait, hang on. Can we try to get like a self med maybe oh that's perfect there we go right okay and off we go right let's not move because i remember that being an issue with um bo3 on launch especially with this map when you go down the uh, elevator it would struggle to load it and everything oh i've not done this since like 2016 i'm actually kind of scared all right okay this is why we needed the masamune ladies and gentlemen because without it we can't get past here and we can't do the boss fight okay i'm a bit scared hello takio fuck you ow ow okay he hurts he hurts real bad okay there's a shit ton of thrashers that are gonna spawn all right i think we'll be okay we'll be okay 
As long as we use the Masamune, we should be good. We also get ammo drops, so we don't have to worry about that, which is nice. Courtesy of this Black Ops 2 mod. We've just got to watch out for when this sport eventually shows up. Come on, show your sport. You know you want to. There we go. Shoot that, and there we go. Right, I think that's phase one or phase two. I'm not too sure. Holy fuck, this KSG is so overpowered, pack a punched. Right, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. Honestly, the only boss fight that I'm really fearing for the last for the, the next one is GK. That's it. Revelations has one of the easiest boss fights ever, man. Okay, there's a sport. All right, there we go. Right, I think there's one more left to shoot off, and it's that one down there. Yeah, I'm right. All right, let's use the skull a bit here. It is what it's most useful for because it's one of the best specialist weapons in the game. Holy shit, there's so many thrashers, man. PhD's making that a little bit easier, though. Oh, that's the last one. All right, I think we're done. Yeah, okay, let's fucking go. ZNS. Oh, get fucked. Oh, my God. Let's fucking go. Bro, this cutscene's actually low-key sad. Man, why does it always do that to me? Okay, Goron Krovi, this totally isn't my third attempt trying to do this. I totally haven't been trying to do this video all week, too. It's fine. It's fine. We don't worry about it. I could be shopping free, please. Nope, of course it isn't. If I sound pessimistic during this run, just know that I was five out of six on the trophies, including the bomb step, and I am fucking raging. I died by a mangler. But it's fine. We move. We, we, we move. We move. We move. We're gonna get it done this time. Okay, let's hit up the gobble gun machine again. Hopefully, we get shopping free. Please, double green, double green. Or even a round robin. I take that, honestly. Oh my fucking god. Okay, perkaholic? Okay, that's good. Just trying to get through this round as fast as possible, honestly, because I couldn't give a fuck about anything else. I really want to do this Easter egg as fast as possible because I'm just sick of the sight of Black Ops 3, man. I've been really getting into other games like Destiny 2 at the minute, and I really can't be bothered to play zombies. I can be bothered to talk about it, no bother. Just, I can't be asked to play like the dish type stuff, like doing every single easter egg. I kind of bit off more than I can chew, I can't lie. And I self made I don't want that. Shopping free, finally. Thank you. And off we go. That one open. That one open. Quickly get these other doors open. We need to flick the power on because a lot of the doors are protected by the power for some fucking reason. Get that one on. It's open. Holy shit, we're making good time. Right, okay, let's grab our first trophy here. There it is. We can also grab a second one when we do the shield, so let's get that done. Shield piece number one. Shield piece number two. That's our dragon command cylinder. That is very nice. And if luck fares me well, the third shield piece will be down here. And is it fuck? Okay. <laughs> It's not on the car either. Of course, it's the furthest location away. The game just hates me. And shield piece number three. Oh, shield piece number... Th Come on, there we go. And let's get this nice and crafted here. Right. God, whatever the fuck that means. I kind of want to end the round before we do anything as well. It would be ideal so we can get some fresh spawns going. So, you know, some more points. Blast this pipe. And there's our second one. Right, let's go call in the Dragon Strike. Dragon Strike? The uh, Dragon Command Groth module here. We can get the first conduit done. This is basically our priority right now. Because we can't do anything else unless we unlock the pack. Get this... Nice and set down. Go. First graph module is always the easiest because it's a really, really low round if you're playing with Megas. And yeah, we are playing with Megas because I really can't be bothered to do it on Classics. Tried that on ZNS and it was fucking abysmal. The gun surrounded this mod is really about, like, the challenge, you know, like, they're doing it with the BO2 weapons. It's not necessarily can I complete it with Classics only. Right, okay, there we go. There's our first conduit. It's a shame all we've got to do now is wait around. I think I'm going to get a round robin on strap. That's perfect because I want the ability to be able to end the round so we can get Valkyries quick. I think we're also going to go hit up the mystery box because this foul is going to start to drop off fairly quickly. A94, perfect. And a nice little secondary, come on. Uh, I don't know, I don't know if I'm fielding an LMG. Okay, I'm fielding an LMG. <laughs> okay, we got Supply Depot. I think that's the one over here, if I'm not wrong. Yes, it is. Call this shit in. That landed very fucking far away. We're going to have to run a marathon for that shit. Okay, two out of three, round four. Very, very good. Okay, there's a second one. Nice. Let's just wait for the third cylinder now. I apologize if the audio is a little bit fucky in this one. I, I do have my fan on because it is scorching hot in my room, even with the window open. So if you guys want videos, I'm not melting to make them. So <laughs> you'll just notice my mic will be a little bit. It'll sound like tinny because um, noise suppression is doing its thing. And there's our final code cylinder. Tank fact pool. Okay, here's our third growth module coming down. Where's it heading? Born in, you fuck. There we go. I actually think that's infirmary. It is. Okay, that went really, really quick. Okay, three out of three growth modules done. Let's get our asses over to pack a punch and let's do some stuff. What stuff, you may ask? You're going to have to wait and see. Call the dragon over and let's go get this fucking stuff. There's the flowers for the upgraded monkey bombs. Why did I pick them up? I have no clue. I am just saying words at this point, bro. My mind is just completely, like, focused on getting back up to where I was because I'm so pissed off. Okay, there's three things we can do here. We can do the toilet, we can do the little controller, and we can grab the egg. Let's do the lockdown first. Where's it going to be first? Okay, here. Having an LMG like this makes it a lot easier, which is kind of why I didn't want to pick it up because it makes it too easy. This lockdown step is very, very easy when you're, like, experienced with G2 
GK. If you're playing GK for the first time, it's you'll shit yourself over it. But honestly, the one when you get further into the Easter egg is far worse. Okay, now we're on the left side, right side, left side? I think left side. I know my left and right, it just depends on which way you want to look at it. I've only been playing for fucking 15 minutes. That's kind of insane. Okay, it should be this side now, and then after that, it'll be all four sides, and then we can go grab the fucking thing, do the other stuff with down there, blah, 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 blah. I know what I'm doing in my head, and I don't have to explain it, because I'm sure all of you guys know how the GK Easter egg goes, but commentary is commentary, and content is content. Probably gonna pack the RPD before we leave as well. There we go, that's that side done. Now, we just gotta kind of sit up here, because there's gonna be so many of them. And there's Valkyries, cool. I just heard one spawn in. Let's just hope we don't get overrun here. We should be okay. We can use the shield if she gets a little bit too hectic. Val is still popping off, so I'm not even complaining about using it. I don't know how it does against, like, these, though. Still fine if you got a fast trigger finger. What about the manglers? Give me a mangler. Oh, there's a mangler. Oh my god, it's fucking tearing them up. We also just unlocked the helmet. Okay, we are gonna have to use our shield blast here because we completely ran out of ammo. Where's he at? Perfect. There we go. Done. Right, I'm gonna pack the... No, fuck it. We'll do the air 94 here. Nice one. Also get that down. Get up. And shoot that. There we go. Perfect. Right, now we've got four out of six trophies. Well, not yet, technically, but we can basically go back and get it. Forgot to pick up a fucking crystal. I always do that, bro. Right, let's just go back anyway. We'll go grab the toilet fucking trophy. It's fine. Don't worry about it. We need to end the rounds anyway to get a Valkyrie round for the valve step. What we can also do before we leave, that bar is stuck on my screen. We can put that down there. I hope that bar goes away when I interact with that again. Oh, fuck. It's stuck on my screen, bro. I apologize if that's going to get like annoying in the record, but I'm too far into this now to restart over a fucking visual glitch. It's fine. Just pretend I'm like slowly doing something. It'll probably go when we... When, it'll, it'll probably go away when we do the download step to the trophy. And the key to crystal number four. Thank you. Okay, now we basically just need to end rounds and also worry about the dragon, but for now, it just needs breathe fire on. Okay, let's head back into the main map and let's go and dragon strike the shit out of that puddle. We get our fourth trophy and then the last two we kind of have to wait around. Actually, what am I saying? We do not have to wait around for the other one. I've realized that that one's just... Um, the fifth one's actually just the one where we have to use the trap. Get our dragon strike out here. Call this shit in. Thank you, my trophy. And we'll go get the other one, which is literally in the room opposite. Click the trap on here and move the fuck out the way because in my last recording, I actually went down to this trap. There's the fifth one and we should probably fucking move because the dragon's coming. Right, we now have five out of six trophies. We just need the one in the safe, but we need the gauntlet for that. Now, I don't know if the dragon did his fire shit on here. I'm not too sure. Dragon egg was cool, so he did, right? We just gotta wait around them. Try to get, like, a round robin or something. Shopping free, that could probably help us get one. Doesn't look like we're getting a round robin. Come back next round. Yep. Okay, it should be cooled by now. Right, okay. Now we can start our napalm kills. So, honestly, let's just wait around here and wait for the, the, the dragon to breathe fire. Or not. Right, we've gotta go do valve step now. Fuck's sake. Right, okay. We're gonna shoot a Valkyrie next to the generator, and then it'll do its sparky bullshit, and then turn on the generator. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I feel like we're getting a lot done. But then again, we do have the entirety of, like, the trophies to do. So, for sake, there is a lot more this, actually. Let's get the RPD pack a punch to you. Okay, generator's on. I'm gone. Time to pull up Cronorium.com. Right, okay. Let's go quickly check if this one up here is the green valve or it has the pink cylinder. Nine times out of ten, it fucking does. Oh, this one is the green valve. Okay. Um. Right, okay. That's our pink cylinder valve in infirmary. So, now we have to go and set department store to one. I can't remember if it was on one. It was. Fuck. My bad. Armory needs to be on two. That's doable, because it's right over here. Tank station on two. That's also doable, but for now, we can go hit up Supply Depot. Supply? Supply Depot. Supply Depot on one. Dragon Command needs to be on three. And then Tank Station needs to be on two. Let's see if we just double check if it hasn't dropped. No, it has not dropped. Okay. Alright, let's go check. I hope it's done, because I really hope this step hasn't bugged. It has a habit of doing that. Perfect! There's our pink cylinder. Let's get this round ended then, so we can start getting our napalm kills with the gauntlet for our sixth trophy. And let's quickly put this into Sophia. Type in Kronos, because for some reason that's the password. I've got no clue why. That's it. Grab our max ammo, and now we just need to wait for the dragon. Ah, oh, I thought that was him, and the fucking the orange glow around my screen came up for some reason. Let's just train some zombies, then. Let's throw away our Widow's Wine grenades. But where are the zombies at? Alright, there's our zombies. Right, now we just need napalm kills, then penetration kills. That's really dope. Okay, here comes the dragon. I can't tell if this is doing penetration kills. I don't think this is doing penetration kills. We need, like, a sniper or some shit. Oh, that, I guess. Okay, whatever. <laughs> M16 will be good, but mm, it's it's not in nah, 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 nah. It's not, it's not, it's not. It's not what we need right now. Our priority is this fucking egg. Okay, that oh, that was counting for penetration kills. Now we just need melee kills. Right, let's go grab the boy knife off the fucking wall here. And I think it should be still a one knife. I'm not sure. We have just enough points for it as well. That's perfect. Oh, it's not a one knife, unfortunately. Fine though. Right, okay, the dragon egg is fully done. Now we just gotta go incubate that shit. Ideally, I want to get over there before they start spawning in. The quicker we slap the dragon egg down, the quicker we can be done with this fucking Easter egg, and I can move on to Rev. Possibly on the same night. I don't know. Get that dragon. Dragon egg in there, and let's start the incubation. We just need to kill zombies now. I feel like I'm cheating a bit using the Regal Mark 3, but then I remembered we 
we've used the wonder weapons in every other fucking map. So I'm saying it's fair game. Okay, right. The lockdown is done, but I kind of want to stay here and finish the round. And also pack a bunch of my guns is probably of like utmost importance because you get to a really high round with this Easter egg. So I don't want to have shit weapons. Okay, let's get these Mark 3s packed here. And once that's done, I think we might try spin for a round robin. I don't know. It's been a little while since we've had one. Ah, some dead man walking. I really was hoping it would be the next one after that because that's going to be really useful for the next step depending on what we get from the trials. Okay, that's a round robin. Very nice. Okay, there we go. Now let's go retrieve our dragon gauntlet thing. 115 punch motherfucking spectacular thing. I, I don't know what I'm saying. Going a little bit stir crazy. I want to do this Easter egg. We are going to do it because we're doing very fucking well. All right, give me my gauntlet now. Thank you very much. Activate this shit. Fly off. Punch the absolute fuck out of this safe. Grab the last trophy and there we go. And Libosh. There we go. Right. All six trophies acquired. If it's the bomb step first, I think I'll kill myself. Fucking TikTok on my phone. Ah, fuck. We gotta go find Groff. This is one of the worst ones, but at least it's not the bomb step first. Ah, there he is. Stop. Okay, he's gone over here. The fucking bitch. Where's he gone? Okay, right. Nice. There we go. Right. Go into the machine and die, please, Gersh. Thank you. Okay, right. Let's get the phone out quick. Don't be the bomb step. Oh, for fuck's sake. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Supply Depot. Whoever just subscribed there, thank you very much. Right, our first one is at supply. Okay, please don't fail me. We're gonna do fine. We're gonna do fine. What do you mean we failed the bombs there? What do you mean? Next one is Dragon Command. I think you get a bit of extra time because it's solo. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. Our next one is Armory. There's Armory done. Right, let's get ourselves over the tank quick, which is our fourth. Right, our, la our second to last one is Department Store. Okay, yeah, that's that one done, and then it's infirmary, 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 run, 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 and then it's infirmary, right? Please? Shit, where's infirmary? It's here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, bomb step done. Oh my god, that's the worst one done. All right, fine, fine. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Before we do any of the ones, our odds of getting like an escort one are pretty high. So I want to try getting undead man walking for anything. Okay, round robin. I will. Oh wait, hang on. It might actually just be end around. Well, that would have been a massive waste. Okay, let's try getting undead man walking here. If it is an escort step, it just makes it ten times easier. I think that's it. Oh fuck this, I'm flipping around. Okay, that should be it there. Okay, nice. Right. Okay, let's go spin the challenge thing here. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. We were so much better off doing that. Let's go get our boy Nemo. And here he comes. This is why Undead Man Walking is the absolute goat for this Easter egg. The only issue we might have is Manglers and Valkyries, but they're easily taken care of with my ray gun. All right, come on. Come this way. Yep. This has to be one of the most riveting Easter egg steps known to man. Honestly, right? I'm having so much fun. And Bosh. There we go. Right, it's done. That was probably one of the most painless ones we've had yet. I hope we get the Groff module one next. It's probably the one of the easiest as well. Perfect. Right, let's see where this shit goes. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? Oh, it's this side. Okay, so every one of these is out the map. You just got to kind of defend it. Undead Man walking might actually fuck us up a little bit here. It's going to slow it down. Is there a gobble gun machine here I can spin? Oh, perfect. There's one here. I think I'm just going to use the ray gun for this, actually. It just makes everything ten times easier. Again, another riveting easter egg step. Thank you very much, Treyarch. Come on, is it nearly done? There we go, it's done. Cool. Right, let's send our dragon boy over to fucking grab it. Right, he's got it. That one was painless too, honestly. Then once we've done this, it's probably the mangler step, so I'm going to try and get myself a undead man walking again, because it's ob obviously the better choice out of all of them. And it'll just help us tenfold. Right, stick that in there and it's done. Right, it is the mangler step. I didn't get an undead man walking, unfortunately, but one will it'll still spawn him. He's got to shoot off his arm and let him run. We just got to keep our eyes out for a green-eyed mangler. I hear a mangler. I don't know if he's green, though. He does not look green. Bro, my game! What the fuck? My game just tabbed out and absolutely fucked me over. Right, well, let's go grab Jug. It's fine. Don't even stress about it. Stamina up here too. Yeah, we're gonna grab that. Nice. Juggernaut's one floor down, and then one more floor down from that is Quick Revive. We did fail that, but honestly, that was not even my fault. My game just alt tabbed me for no fucking reason. Okay, Perkaholic. Perfect. That's literally what I needed. Let's go restart this challenge. That was just absolute chaos from the game itself there. Right, let's go find our green mangler. He'll spawn in eventually. I usually like waiting around spawn because I think he's more likely to actually spawn around there.
Third time's the charm. This has to be genuinely, like, the worst one. Well, no, the worst one's the bomb step, but, like, even that's, like, easy to an extent. This is just, like, RNG. It's fucking annoying. Okay, we've actually got him. He just needs to run. But where is he? Okay, I am baffled as to how this step actually works, man. It's doing my fucking head in. That took... 10 rounds, bro. Oh my god, I never want to have to do that step ever again. I hate that step. I actually, that is awful. Okay, now we've just got to go do the download step. That one's easy. That is so easy peasy. You already know where we're going. We are going to the house to download the port. To download the uh, uh, trans-dimensional fucking information. I don't know. All right, now that we've got the key card, we can head back over. Console's cooling down. I totally didn't just, like, you know, cut the when I didn't forget to pick up the key card. Yeah, uh, thanks for exposing me, game. Let's actually head over there. There now with the key card this time oh this cutscene never gets old bro it's so good bro this cutscene's amazing okay here we go this is definitely the worst one in regards of just like how tedious it is i can't lie what side is it now is it the side okay wait do we just get manglers if so that is really easy it's a nice calm one to end it off and then we've got to go do the boss fight you know this is actually really easy now that we have the ray gun <laughs> okay we're about three quarters of the way there i actually don't know how to make this interesting half of it's pretty much been cut out we're just killing manglers you can't really do much okay we should be about done here and there we go we're done cool right gotta go take this download the dragon command and then we're officially done we're gonna go give the power court to nikolai and then that's it we're done well for now we're gonna go boss fight and stuff but you know feeling good honestly Posit the key card and then that should be it yeah there we go right we have the power cores now and i'm pretty sure this just means we can continue with the easter egg now we have to go give the court to nikolai and then we are done boss fight time now we get to punch zombies for a bit which is also oh i thought you could oh you can punch them out the sky Honestly, I think I'm ready. I've got a pack up and rig on Mark III. We've got a cheat charm. <laughs> We've got a RPD. Bro, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, here we go. Sophia's going to fly off. This bit's kind of cool, actually. Okay, boss fight time. Here we go. Yeah, that they're going to be really annoying in this fight. Them fucking teleporting zombies. They can piss off. going to grab this max ammo now. Oh, shit. Okay, here we go. Breathe your fire. Spit your shit. Okay, this boss fight's easy, bro. What do you mean? Okay, there's this weak spot. Come on. There we go. First one down. We just kind of have to watch out for the flames. This, this part of the boss fight's really easy it's all it's also why it's like infinitely important to have like a full shield which we didn't have but you know it's fine ah fuck it this is why we brought self-med. Okay, there's the second bit of the dragon gone. Very nice. I didn't even realize he'd gone up. Right, we need to wait for Nikolai to shoot his thing. Okay, there we go. There's the final bit. Come on. And there we go. Dragon's dead. Cool. <laughs> right, that's phase one of the boss fight done. Now we've got the other phase. Arguably the hardest. It's fine, though. Fucking bar still on the screen, man. Oh, my fucking God, bro. He hurts. He hurts like a bitch. Oh, my God. He has wraps. What the fuck? Where's his power core at? Where's his power core at? Did we get a hit on him? I can't tell. Yeah, we did. Cool, 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 cool. Nice. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. There's a max ammo in the middle here. I'm going to quickly grab that. I mean, I did want to quickly... I'm going down here. Literally just wanted the fucking max ammo, man. Oh my god! Did we do it? Bro, that was short and sweet. Holy shit. That's GK done. Oh my god. Oh my god, we finished GK solo. That's the first time I've ever done that. All right, on the revelations. It's what I would have done if we lived in an ideal world. I have genuinely been up since 12 a.m. this morning trying to figure out why Black Ops 3 does not want to play a ball with any weapon mod with the Revelations map. It's either one of two issues. Either the weapon mod completely takes out the Apothic and Servant and the Thunder Gun, making the Easter Egg literally impossible as you need these two weapons, or you get thousands and thousands and thousands of script errors because of hit markers or some shit. I've been trying to wrap my head around this, and I'm genuinely ready to just throw the towel in. I'm really, really sorry for you guys, as, as I know the title said that this was going to be every single COD Zombies map from Black Ops 3, but I just can't get this working. And if anybody, and I mean anybody knows anything about this and can help out please comment down below a mod that you know that works and i will follow this video up unlisted with a revelations attempt with all that said thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you have watched all the way to the end that means so much to me and i will see you all in the next video